Genesis, chapter 6. And it came to pass, when men began to multiply on the face of the ground, and daughters were born to them, that the sons of God saw the daughters of men that they were fair, and they took themselves wives of all that they chose. And Yahweh said, My spirit shall not strive with man for ever, for that he also is flesh, yet shall his days be a hundred and twenty years. The Nephilim were in the earth in those days, and also after that, when the sons of God came to the daughters of men, and they bore children to them, the same were the mighty men that were of old, the men of renown. And Yahweh saw that the wickedness of man was great in the earth, and that every imagination of the thoughts of his heart was only evil continually. And Yahweh regretted that he had made man on the earth, and it grieved him to his heart. And Yahweh said, I will destroy man whom I have created from the face of the ground, both man, and beast, and creeping things, and birds of the heavens, for I am sorry that I have made them. But Noah found favor in the eyes of Yahweh. These are the generations of Noah. Noah was a righteous man, and perfect in his generations, Noah walked with God. And Noah begat three sons, Shem, Ham, and Japheth. And the earth was corrupt before God, and the earth was filled with violence. And God saw the earth, and, behold, it was corrupt, for all flesh had corrupted their way upon the earth. And God said to Noah, The end of all flesh is come before me, for the earth is filled with violence through them, and, behold, I will destroy them with the earth. Make you an ark of gopher wood, rooms shall you make in the ark, and shall pitch it within and without with pitch. And this is how you shall make it, the length of the ark 300 cubits, the breadth of it 50 cubits, and the height of it 30 cubits. A light shall you make to the ark, and to a cubit shall you finish it upward, and the door of the ark shall you set in the side thereof, with lower, second, and third stories shall you make it. And I, behold, I am bringing the flood of waters upon this earth, to destroy all flesh, in which is the breath of life, from under heaven, everything that is in the earth shall die. But I will establish my covenant with you, and you shall come into the ark, you, and your sons, and your wife, and your sons' wives with you. And of every living thing of all flesh, two of every sort shall you bring into the ark, to keep them alive with you, they shall be male and female. Of the birds after their kind, and of the cattle after their kind, of every creeping thing of the ground after its kind, two of every sort shall come to you, to keep them alive. And take to yourselves of all food that is eaten, and gather it to you, and it shall be for food for you, and for them. Thus Noah did, according to all that God commanded him, so did he.